Welcome back to another episode of the Fog Dog Exclusive. Uh, today is Saturday, which means that we're heading off to the track this morning. Uh, it's currently 5 to 5 in the morning, uh, and I have quite a big track session this morning. This time next week, uh, a week today, I'm going to be racing a 1500 uh, and you probably saw the 1500, or you might not have seen the 1500 in last week's video, but uh, if you didn't see it, I ran a 348 1500 um, a week ago now and I'm having another crack next weekend, so hoping to go a bit quicker. Um, this morning, I'm going to be doing a lactic session, so my session this morning is three sets of 2x400 uh, with a one minute recovery between the reps and then a seven minute recovery between sets. So short recovery between the reps and then a big recovery between the sets. Uh, and this morning we're going to be at the track with quite a lot of the Burt Squad members. So uh, I know that for sure we're going to have Peter Brack, Daddy Bracken, uh, Luke Bike McCutcheon, he's going to be there, and the famous Matt Hanso is going to be there as well. And rumour has it this morning Matt Hanso is actually doing his 1K time trial. Uh, for his 1,000 subscriber special. Uh, I think that video will be coming out a couple of days after this video comes out. So if you're watching this and you're watching it late, uh, you can probably find Matt Hanso's video uh, of his 1K time trial. But if you're watching it as soon as it comes out, uh, I think you're gonna have to wait a couple of days to see what Matt Hanso runs. But yeah, heading to the track, big session today, looking forward to it. Uh, as soon as we get there, I'm gonna be walking warming up and then yeah we'll be straight into the session so enjoy We have made it to the track. I'm gonna go and warm up. Rumor has it, the word on the street right now is that Matt Hanso has an awful mullet uh, that was cut at home last night. Stay tuned, after warm up, you might get to get a sneak peek of it. As it turns out, uh, after speaking to Matt Hanso in the warm-up, I found out that he posted his video, uh, well, he posted another video midweek. Uh, so you've probably all seen his 1K time trial by now. Uh, he's about to do it, here he is, with the mullet. Um, the mullet looking fresh. But yeah, he has already done his 1K time trial by the time you're watching this, obviously. Um, so we have no idea what he's gonna run, but hopefully uh, he had a good one. I am about to start my session in a few minutes. Uh, I actually did a very similar session to this in England in June last year. Uh, six by 400 with short rest and then a big rest every second rep. Uh, and I think from memory, uh, I looked at the Strava a few days ago, I think I went 60, 59, 57, 58, 56, 55. So uh, I might not close it like that, but I'm gonna try and kind of at least get sub 60 average, but who knows, we'll see how it goes. spiked up, uh, ready to get going. I'm here with Luke Bike McCutcheon. Uh, he's gonna be doing an 800 time trial today. So I'm gonna do my first rep, uh, and then I've got a one minute recovery, 
And then for my second rep, I'm gonna pace Luke Bike McCutcheon for the first lap of his 800. See so how I go, see if I can hold on. Yeah, <laughs> should be good. Uh, kind of nervous, probably gonna get quite lactic today. Uh, obviously running six by 400 quite hard, uh, but big recoveries every second rep. So hopefully we'll be all right. All right, we're gonna do a run through and then we'll be straight into the session. Decent start, Ad. Yeah. What did you get for that? About 58 er? 58 ish, yeah. <laughs> Tidy. Set down uh, both around 58. I think the second lap might have been a tiny bit slower, but I'm not sure.
Come on, Ed. Three sets, two by 400 done. Uh, we got Mr. Matt Hanso here, 241 for his 1K, so pretty solid. Uh, he ran a 208, 800 on what, Tuesday? And a 15. Yeah, and a 1500 uh, for what, 13? 13, yeah. So two PBs for him. Uh, I think based on that 1K, he can probably take a lot off at least the 800, probably the 1500 as well, but my math is not working right now. Uh, for me, pretty solid day. I think I went 59, 58, uh, and then 56 ish for the rest of them, um, so pretty happy with that. Definitely quite tough in the end, especially solo, but had Matt Egan out there on the bike for some of it as well, so uh, yeah, pretty good day. Looking forward to the 1500 next weekend, uh, so stay tuned and we'll see you in that Definitely video. Definitely stay tuned, he's very fit man. <laughs> he looks so effortless when he runs, so. Right. 56 looks like 72, so, you know, very fit. Watch, totally watch his face. Like <laughs> see you in the next video. Next week. On the Fog Dog Exclusive. Welcome back to another episode of the Fog Dog Exclusive. Uh, today is race day, so racing another 1500 this afternoon. Uh, two weeks ago today, I ran a 348 uh, season opener, first 1500 since June 2019. Fog Dog is back on the track for his second 1500 meters of 2020, being paced for a fast race by Luke Bike McCutcheon. Fog Dog is hoping to go much faster than his 1500 meter season opener of 348.35, but will he do it? Who knows? <laughs> See all of this and more next Thursday, October 8th, 7pm Central Time. Exclusive.